Today we'll talk about organization of motion graphic templates inside Premiere Pro. Thanks to this feature we can implement the power of After Effects into Premiere Pro. But the problem is that Essential Graphics panel gets messy very quickly, especially if we have a lot of motion graphic templates. So today I will share with you, in my opinion, the best way to install and organize motion graphic templates in Essential Graphics panel. I've already mentioned in my video about new features in 13.1 version that you can simply drag and drop motion graphic templates to Essential Graphics panel to install them. So this is super easy. But the fact is, I wouldn't recommend this method. This is not the way I install my motion graphic templates. Why you may ask? because this will install the templates in the default location. The installation method that I use is kind of hidden in the panel menu and it's called manage additional folders. You simply choose a location of your folder with motion graphic templates and they will be installed automatically. There are two main advantages to this method. First of all, you can add motion graphic templates to this folder anytime and they will be automatically updated in Premiere Pro. And secondly, we can choose a folder located in, for example, Dropbox or any other cloud-based storage solution and it will let us to access the templates from anywhere and to share them with our collaborators. Okay, so the templates installed. Now it's time to organize them inside the panel. First thing we want to do to have a full control over the templates is to actually disable the default templates that are already installed in the panel. We would probably not gonna use them anyway. So just uncheck the libraries and choose the local folder you want to look at. My approach is as follows. I create a separate Dropbox folder for any brand that I have a separate version, separate set of motion graphic templates for. And next I just select the folders I want to have access to at any given time. For example, this is the folder that I use for my cut to the point videos. All of the templates here are also available to my Patreon supporters. Next setting we want to tweak a little bit is sorting inside the panel. We can choose between sort by title or recent. The latter will change the order anytime we use a template. Personally, I like to have my motion graphic template sorted by title because it lets me organize them inside Dropbox folder. And the last option I like to use is to mark the certain templates that I use most often as favorites. This way you can filter the results to favorites only. If you want a few free motion graphic templates to play with, you can sign up for my mailing list and I will send it to you. And remember that you can turn any After Effects animation you already have to motion graphic template. Also, another great source of motion graphic templates is Envato Market. I have a kind of love-hate relationship with ready-to-go templates, but some of them are really great. And I really believe that using motion graphics is one of the best ways to elevate production value for your videos. Uh, I forgot to say, if it's your first time here, Cut to the Point channel is all about mastering film editing and about streamlining the editing process. Subscribe and see you next time.